Hey, what's going on? It's Fats, and I'm here with Modified Media. Uh, we're at the View Hotel, beautiful view. Let's talk about Twitter versus Facebook. Now, people in Eastbourne and East Sussex, they're all going crazy on Twitter, but it's one of the lowest engaging platforms. So, why are people on Twitter? I believe myself that they're getting outdated advice, which is unfortunate. If you look at people in the local area, they've got anything from 100 followers up to 22,000 followers. Look it up. Uh, they're getting no engagement. Now, the quickest way to grow online is engagement or advertising. You need something to be engaging. So a lot of people want to get viral content so they can get engagement, which helps them grow for free. Or you can pay, you can boost your posts, shouldn't do it, promotions, uh, campaigns on social media. So why are so many people going to Twitter with low engagement and it's not good for B2C, that's business to customer relations. Twitter is good for blog posts, gossip, news, celebrities. It's good for that sort of stuff. Some business to business stuff, but if you're looking to sell, looking to grow, looking to express yourself with visual stuff like videos, photos, you need to be on Instagram and Facebook. They're the highest engaging platforms at the moment. They're leading the social media industry and you need to be on them as a business owner. You need the engagement, you need the growth. You can build relationships with your visual content. Video is winning right now, 70% higher engagement with video content. Why are you not on Instagram? Why are you not on Facebook? That's just me explaining it for you. Get on Instagram, get on Facebook, build your brand, get visual, get the camera phone out, get some videos, get some photos, and build and grow on there. Engage with people, use your hashtags. Twitter is getting you nothing, unfortunately. Look at your engagement, look at your results, and then come back to me. That's Fats from Modify Media. I'm out, peace.